Hello, it's Ben. Thank you for joining us for our virtual PD series on our Google Chrome browser. So let's go ahead and jump right in. So the first thing we need to understand is we need to make sure that we are logged into our Chrome browser. So you can be logged into Google in certain tabs, but you're not logged into your Chrome browser. And the way to know that you're logged into your Chrome browser is that in, in the top right hand corner, you see your uh, beginning of your email address. If you see like a little Lego man, um, that means you're not logged in. You need to click on that little Lego man and log into Chrome browser. You only have to do it once, uh, but once you do it, you're good to go. And it'll go through a couple little setup features for you. Um, and you wanna make sure that you just follow the steps. And when I ask you to link your data, you wanna go ahead and do that. So we wanna to focus today on extensions. Okay, so our Chrome browser is already pretty awesome. It gives us a lot of cool features, but we can add features to it. Okay, so let's learn how to do that. So let's go do a little shopping. So we're gonna open up a new tab by just clicking right here. And I'm gonna type in the Chrome store. I'm gonna click enter. And then I'm gonna click on the very first option here. Now let's do the second option, Chrome Web Store Extensions. Okay, so once I'm in here, I'm gonna find all these extra little programs that I can add to my Chrome browser um, that will basically give it lots of cool functions. So up here, you can see I have a bunch of extensions up here um, that add to all the things that um, I do on the internet. Okay, so for instance, one of those things that I really like, one of the extensions I really like is the URL shortener. So if I click on that, it gives me a shortened URL the site I'm on. I also like the feature of save to my drive. Um, but basically when I'm searching Google images and I find an image I can like, I can click on it and it saves right to my drive. So instead of having to download it to my hard drive, um, I can just save it right to my drive. I can have a calculator. I can do an awesome screenshot. Um, I have an ad block for YouTube. Okay. I also have an ad block for pop-up ads. Um, I have Screencastify, which is this icon right here. And it's how I'm making this video for you guys right now. So it's a screen capture device. I also have Grammarly. Grammarly is what allows me to type an email and have it automatically be spell checked by Grammarly so I don't send out emails that are just riddled with grammatical errors and misspellings. So basically this Chrome store is just loaded with all these really great extensions. Um, and you can just scroll through them, you can click on them, see what they're about and add them to your um, Chrome browser. But some of those ones that I mentioned already are some of the ones I would definitely think about adding to your Chrome browser. Um, you know, one of the really great things is that some of them operate in the background so that once you add them to your Chrome browser, you never have to worry about them ever again. So for instance, I have this ad blocker for YouTube. Um, once I added it to my Chrome browser, I never had to use it again. It just automatically, when I go to YouTube, it just blocks all the ads for me. So it's really quite fantastic. Um, some of them you do have to know how to use, so obviously, my screen Castify extension that I'm using right now, you know, you have to know how to use that. So that might take a little bit more training and I'd be happy to help you out with it. But just know that there's this fantastic Chrome web store that has all these great uh, extensions that will add all these new functions to your Chrome browser and hopefully make your uh, time on the Chrome browser more efficient and more enjoyable. Thanks guys, have a great day.